collector so i'm gonna do another bead here this is gonna be a part two i'll back off of the first energy that i picked up on and i have everyone's attention at this time all right so let's get some time frame overs first i feel like some real sadness here in this energy this energy is heavy and it's coming from a master it's coming from two masters i feel like it's coming from two fire signs and i just heard gemini there's a gemini involved somebody wants someone to shut up um, I feel like somebody doesn't want someone to enjoy the sex, but they are enjoying it, and or whoever they're having sex with. They don't want these people to enjoy it, but they are, and it's like when they mock this masculine, it's even more irritating than angry because it's like he's just like sick, but he has no choice because an entity is riding him. An entity is running him. This entity could be taking over him. So now, um, Divine Feminine, I think you're getting more clarity about a situation, and it's like, wow. It's like the limps somebody win to win like wow and lying what's the message you said for your team for this energy what's the messages it's coming for you sooner than you expect so something is coming in here and it's coming in sooner than i expected this is God. This is nothing but God stepping into a situation. This is messed up. April is significant in this situation. The summertime could be significant. Distract yourself from the waiting game. Don't wait around. But just know that something is coming. Okay? Winter is significant. Six months from now is significant as well. September is significant. Not anytime soon. Okay? In August... And we have before, it says refocus and stop waiting for it. Stop rushing things, okay? Next month. All right, so we're going to leave it there. Things happen sooner when you focus your energy on you. Okay, so divine masculine divine feminine, focus on you at this time. Okay, Holy Spirit, step into this energy. Oh, God. Oh, God. Praise your holy name. Please protect your children and children. Assets. Assets could be of significant here. If I can talk. Release all throats all energy. Okay, so we have an emperor coming through at this time. Nine of Pentacles. Upright energy is here as well, too. So an emperor is going towards a nine of pentacles energy. <clears throat> yeah, an empress upright energy. What's the messages? Okay, so we have the hair font in the reverse. So somebody is out of Hermit mode. Somebody wants someone to go back to Hermit mode, go back to Hermit mode. I feel like there's a masculine that's out of crossroads that wants to go within, probably can't go within. Let's get the two of wands reverse. We can take a closer look at the hair font though. This energy is like, it's like sad. It's sad. Wow. It's heavy. Wow. They're doing a lot of magic as well, Divine Feminine. Especially if you're getting headaches out of nowhere. So with the hair front coming out in the reverse, a reminder that you, that, a reminder that you are your own teacher. All the wisdom you see comes from within, not from some external source of power. You are being guided to follow your own path and adopt your own spiritual belief systems rather than bl blindly following others. So, um, to a long reverse, this masculine needs to stop. I, I, I said that stop reacting, but um, the two of wands reverse, maybe it's hard. Like literally, maybe his penis is just like real hard here. And it's like it can't, like, it's a time, it's like this thing is riding this man. <clears throat> Two of Wands reverse. You might decide to stay put and choosing the safest option due to fear of change and fear of the unknown. So let's see who's in this energy. Because we didn't ask me, it could be somebody else. Two of Wands reverse. What is this? Three of Wands reverse. I feel like this is this uh, third party energy because I see the three of wands reverse. She's heartbroken that this masculine wants to be with someone else. 
So this is somebody from his masculine's past. Could be a Virgo here. Yeah. He actually wants to be the Knight of Cups upright, just not for her. Ace of Wands is here. So she put an entity on him to stop this. Devon Finham, uh, something could be significant with head shaking, saying no. If you ever came in contact with this person. If you ever seen this person. We have the Wheel of Fortune here. So um, things are taking a turn in this situation. But yeah, this is her energy. This is this other woman's energy. You don't want to let go and did anything to win. Wow. They did anything and everything to win. There could be a matriarch energy involved here. We got the Eight of Cups reverse. Wow. I feel like this masculine want to take back every cup he ever gave this person. Wow. You may fear moving on, which can result in stagnation and staying in a bad situation. Do not be afraid of leaving something behind if it is no longer serving you. So um, this masculine is afraid, maybe, eight of cups, reverse, because he don't want to be alone either. You know, these two people have a lot in common. Four of Pentacles is here. They have a lot of common. You know, they both don't want to be alone. Um, you know, they both, he, maybe he's just like, Worried about, also worried about if he leaves, it's like, am I leaving for nothing? So he may just stay because it's like, he don't want to be by himself. I, he, I feel like he's in fear because of what happened. It's like, she is the only one that can handle it or uh, certain people, karmics are the only people that can handle something like this. So it's like, um, or he feel like they should deal with it. So he just going to stay because it's like, damn, if, you, if you're not going to be there to buy food, he's just like, maybe I'm just going to stay then. Like, like, but they, they are still scared because, like, they don't know what's going to happen. Somebody just, like, it could be all over the place, you know? They don't know, they don't know where their life is going. Four of Pentacles, wow. We got the Ten of Pentacles. This was all for money. Four and five, four and ten. That's 14. So, 14 could be significant as well. Children can be involved. Four of Pentacles. Let's take a closer look at that. This is heavy. Yeah. So, I'm make sure you cleanse him, okay? Because somebody here is like, I know I was wrong, but I ain't want to. Like, I feel like, dang, I don't know. Mm. It was messed up. I, I saw that. Last thing. Four of Pentacles upright. You are holding on to people, possessions, situations, or past issues for a sense of security, perhaps in a possessive or toxic way. Um, yeah, this is all for the love of money. Four of Pentacles with the Ten of Pentacles. We have Justice. What's this? We have the Ace of Pentacles and we have the Three of Cups. So, yeah, this was a group effort. Justice came out crossing. I feel like these people will, don't want to face karma or, or, or don't want to go to jail or they don't want to face justice. You know, something Ace of Pentacles with the Three of Cups. Wow. We got the Five of Swords in the reverse. Let's go close in here. Um, you are ready to resolve conflict at work or at home, ready to make amends, release stress, and move on. Sometimes peaceful resolutions and overcoming challenges can turn into further escalation. So I feel like these people want to give up. You know, it's like they did it for the love of money, but they, yeah, they're in fear of this justice. They, it's a lot probably already happened. So it's like, all right, you know what I'm saying? We don't want to do nothing. But I feel like there's still somebody in this energy that wants this masculine to be a king of pentacles in the reverse or is trying to make them to be a king of pentacles in the reverse that's still like fighting I, this is that matriarch energy she feels like this masculine should have a woman that takes care of him or could be able to financially take care of him so that he can stay tied to this devilish energy so there's a matriarch energy that don't want this masculine to move forward that's trying to hold him back from this empress because she's threatened and jealous by this empress 
this person probably don't even really understand why she don't like this interest. She has an entity attachment. And this empress's light irritates her demons, basically. So with the moon and the magician. So she hasn't had enough. She's still um, doing moon magic on the moon cycles. And she's still doing magic period. This matriarch energy. So take that how it resonates. Do take what resonates and leave what doesn't. What's the message you hear for people for this energy? We have the page of wands. So there's some stalking going on here. We got the page of swords. It's a lot of air energy. So an air sign, Aquarius. A Gemini or Libra, page of swords. Let's take a closer look at that page of swords. It's a lot of watching going on. Everybody's watching. All right, the page of swords upright. You have ideas, plentiful. You are inspired, curious, and a great communicator. Your thrust is knowledge, can lead to interesting discoveries you are quick witted and inquisitive direct and truthful and young at heart so not everybody in the energy is like trying to attack people just like damn like oh so oh like okay i felt like a lot of people like were led to hate somebody here and i was like oh okay or um wow so this what this is like type energy page of wands with the page of swords for some for some we got the Ace of Swords in reverse. There's, yeah, so I feel like somebody could have also lied and said that somebody wasn't like that. Somebody was something else. So people, a lot of people could have been led the wrong way or led to think something else, put under some type of illusion. And this is being exposed. You see how the cards fell out collective. I ain't do nothing. All right. Three of Pentacles is here. All right. Which got the collaboration off the ground. Yeah, by this person here that wants to attack somebody with the death card. This person could be creating their own demise or they're trying to attack somebody to kill them. This is that matriarch energy. That, that, that uh, there's a woman, an older woman here. Yeah, we got the moon. She be doing stuff on the moon. Could be a Pisces here. She be doing stuff on the moon cycle. And this woman can also be calling to the moon, conjuring up demons and all this stuff. Like I said, she hasn't had enough. She didn't get her money. Maybe she's holding a grudge as well. She's murdering herself. That's all I know. We got the Knight of Pentacles here. Clarify this Knight of Pentacles. So a Taurus could be in this energy. Why is this Knight of Pentacles here? I'm like, so we got the Queen of Cups. So somebody wants another woman to be their true authentic self. And they're this innocent Queen of Cups sweetie pie here okay and he wants to give look how I, the cards fell out they facing each other he wants to give to this woman because at the end of the day she deserved it is how this person is feeling she deserved it so he want to give to this person that deserves this okay two of cups yeah i can't make this up he want a relationship with this woman man and he want to be in the upright fully in the upright But then the Ten of Cups is in the reverse. Somebody's trying to have success. Mm -hmm. yeah. Two of Cups upright. Four of Cups reverse. I feel like these comments also, they, everybody trying to manipulate the energy. Let's just stop trying to like fool somebody here. And let's just come straight to face to face. Like for real. That's it. That's, that's what it got to be. So... We got the four of cups reversed. So somebody could have lost a lot and gave up a lot when they decided to take this journey towards wherever they went. I feel like they went to a, a tarot reader or, or some type of practitioner. Eight of swords. Let's look at that. And got lied to, tricked, raped, everything. Like eight of swords, bro. So with this eight of swords coming out upright, it's like you may feel trapped or restricted by your thoughts or your situation. You may feel as though you have no choice. You are having your hands tied. You may feel helpless, powerless in a situation, but it, but this is usually not the case if you are considering the big picture. So this masculine could have felt like threatened by this woman. So it's like, that's why he took this leap of faith. Because he felt threatened by his woman. He thought he didn't have any control over this woman. The fool with the eight of swords. So that's why he blames this woman. 
because it's like he didn't have any control. He wanted some control. Not a wands with the six of swords, but I still feel like you went about a situation the wrong way, which is why you have no choice. You got to face this judgment. There's no way around it. You got to face judgment. Knight of wands with the six of swords. Yeah, so it, it I guess it put this person in some flighty energy. It made them travel and look around for this Empress's replacement because he didn't have the upper hand in the relationship. And he was successful. He found Six of Swords. You know, he found um, some type of replacement. This wasn't what he was looking for. You are training, progressing, moving into calmer waters. You might be reaching the end of a difficult period. I also feel like he could be progressing through something here. I also feel like the divine stepped in on the situation and called judgment too. With that judgment being there. This masculine is growing. It definitely reverse. He's definitely trying to grow. He's growing. Not a wands with the six of swords. Damn. Four of wands reverse. Wow. I feel like this person can function due to this attachment. They can't make money. They can't function. They got to just sit here and just like have sex. Four of Wands reverse. You might have a lack of com community spirit in your life and an instability at home or lack of teamwork around you. There might be postponed reunions or canceled celebrations. Yeah. That's why this masculine can't come forward because he can't function. Like people will look at him like he's not a regular person or maybe um, this feminine will look at him like he's not a regular person because it's like all you want to do is have sex. All you want to do is have sex. That's all he want to do is have sex. Like he can't do, he can't function. Why would somebody do this to another human being? That's so green. Why would somebody do this to another? Why would you just want to lay down and fuck? Like really? Why? And just like, why would you take somebody's life like that? Four of Wands reverse. Why? Five of Pentacles. Yeah, these people are. This is a low vibing person that did this. It was all out of like just hate, jealousy, a Virgo, bro. This person has no strength right now. Oh my God. King of Pentacles in the reverse. That's why this masculine is broke and ain't got nothing because this because this is broke. Oh, he refused to let this person go. He should have let this person go. This person could be in a lot of regret because it's like she cost him his money, everything, everything, everything. This person was somebody with money, not even nobody with money. Wow. She took everything from him. Wow. This is sad. Five of Swords reverse. This is crazy, guys. This bitch is crazy. This green, that's some green ass shit. Why would you do that? Why a Gemini could be involved here that was pushing the issue as well with the Five of Cups in the reverse? Her wish is not being fulfilled. There's another matriarch energy in this energy, too, like I said. So. Maybe the sex is the magic could be getting weaker, but it's not done yet, and the sex is not like as good as, as it was supposed to be. And I feel like people, these niggas uh, just need to knock over some cups, like right? yeah. But you can't ask this divine feminine to wait on you, and she don't deserve to have to wait on you. I'm sorry, sir. Like you shouldn't have went over there. You decided to go out and look for somebody else. Give this divine feminine the opportunity to do that as well too. She gets her out. You know things got revealed. All right, but. She deserves a chance at new love. Honestly, when you really think about it, she deserves it because you could have had a conversation with this woman and work things out. Had you had prior to getting with anybody, did work on yourself, did some shadow work on yourself, did work on yourself, period, face yourself in the mirror and say, you know what, this is what's wrong with you, you know? Instead of like being so quick to do it for other people, that's, that's we need to come together as a collective and realize like we gotta start doing work on ourselves. like. I'm the problem type energy. <sighs> Queen of Swords with the Two of Cups reverse. This is um, yeah, so secrets got revealed that, you know, somebody is not someone's par partner. This this is bringing a big ass tower for someone here. Wow. Nine of Wands reverse. 
Ace of Wands reverse. It's like plans are failing. Things ain't working out. Like this is this is deep, guys. It's hard with the moon reverse. Masculine or this feminine didn't want a cycle to end out between her and this masculine because he had money. Not because she loved him, like how this real divine empress, the real two of cups loved him. Because she wanted money. This is definitely a karmic. And that made the situation even more fucked up. The tie with the world in place. This masculine is really thinking about offering this bitch. And I don't have nothing to say about that. Six of Wands. She had success. She took someone's life. Literally. And she took someone's relationship. She took someone's home. She... This masculine really wants to grow. Like, damn. But he I, he's stuck here. Damn. Like, she... Binded him. The devil reversed the king of pentacles reverse. Three of swords reverse. Damn, this is crazy. Like is he's like that's messed up. But you can't ask this blind feminine to stay and wait on you. Sorry. Although you are experiencing conflict, loss, or separation in life, there's a great desire to release pain, overcome sorrow, and recover from hardship or heartbreak. I think it's time to let go of Divine Feminine for now. And I feel like Divine Feminine needs to let go of Divine Masculine for now. And um, we y'all got to step away from each other to come together again. But this man is sleeping with a lot of different women who want Divine Feminine's life. Who now know about the situation. Who are now enlightened. So... They're going to do it now. Now this group of women are going to do whatever they have to do to keep these two people apart. So it's like. I don't know. I just. One thing we got to start. We got to start with though is them. These two people got to break up. That's that's where that's where we got to start. What's the outcome here? for team? It's energy. Seven of swords reverse. Let's look at that. Heavy. Truths are coming to right now. Yeah. The truth are all right, the truth is out here. A lot got revealed. Um, a lot got revealed. A lot is still getting revealed as well too about this situation. I also feel like there's legal problems here. Five of Wands. So because the truth is out. Um, it's causing a lot of conflict as well, too. Like, people are mad with the death here in reverse. Because this masculine wanted to, he want to grow. He want to grow. He want to, he, he want to grow. And somebody is trying to keep him stuck. Like, he has to deal with a lot because he'll never, either he, I don't think he's going to. That's another reason why this Carmen may be trying to come and be like, um, you, you, you will accept. Um, a king of cups in the reverse because um, I had them fucked around and did some out of I wasn't thinking my bad and it's like no I'm sorry but this woman don't deserve that just do the work and go through your karmic cycle and catch somebody another lifetime or hope for the best that you can see this person again and something could be worked out now in the pentacles reverse yeah there's a nine of pentacles in the reverse here, yeah, that he's binded to. She binded herself through this heart and not blood. Nine of pentacles reverse. She killed a child. She got pregnant and murdered the baby. Three of wands for some of you. Or just the, or he could have signed his name in blood. All of, all of the above as well. Yeah, and this was a group effort. Nine of Pentacles, yeah, the mom, the matriarch, matriarchs that are involved, they helped this happen because they wanted to steal from another woman because they were jealous and envious. And they are clicking up with other jealous and envious people to make sure that these two people never come together again. So let's get some messages from the sexual magic. the energy spirit can I just have everything thank you 
What's the message you So, yeah, I feel like some of the spirit guides are no longer with them, around them. But they were definitely trying to talk to someone. Or they probably are trying to connect with someone right now. We have the high priestess. I also feel like this masculine is trying to manifest off of the women that he's sleeping with to talk to the empress to somehow trick some energy trick something do something what else this is heavy guys it's a lot of sex sex here it's a lot of sex here they're trying to keep this masculine distracted but he can't he obsessed with this empress and these karmics know it they know it and that, that was the, the plot to his to it all. But that was nothing but God, man. That was nothing but God. Knight of Pentacles, yeah. This person wants to give give this empress something or give her something. He possibly want to travel to give her something. Meet up with her. Oh, some sex. A gift sex as well, too. Um, or maybe not even sex, like just chill, watch a movie, hang out, eat something, or um, give head, play around. You know, gotta be much. Uh, maybe he don't, maybe he don't even want to have sex. He want to chill, hang out. Yeah, because he's in the, he's really depressed. He's in a really dark place. Yeah, because maybe that's what they did. They chilled a lot. This empress probably didn't. Yeah, but he's dealing with a lot of group sex and a lot of sexual partners and a lot of people trying to hold him back, hold him down. And he's dealing with also this person that he has a trauma bond with when it comes to this child. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But this Empress, no, she, she can't even compete. She don't, she don't compare to this divine feminine. She know that. This Empress, Empress, you know that this woman don't compare to you either. She know that. Everybody know that shit. That's why she did what she did. She don't even, she, he wanted to be with both of y'all and give you one. He wanted to keep two. You know what I'm saying? But once things got started to, you know, this woman started to feel some type of way. She probably ain't let him know he was in some type of way. But she started to feel some type of way about um divine feminine. She got threatened. And she wanted him to be only all over her. She got greedy. So she put a sex entity attachment onto this man. Because it's like, she wanted, yeah, she wanted to be queen. She wants to be the empress. She wanted everything. She wanted to get married to him. She wanted the love and attention. She wanted everything. And now this man, damn, is out here like this. Because this entity could be taking over him. It's he could be starting to look different. His appearance could be changing, or it could change when he when this entity, when he lets it, you know, uh, get do what it has to do for the, for the time being. Yeah, I feel like this woman is really satisfied too with the with the sex. Yeah, but this man is not. He's missing someone. He's aware, consciously aware that this is crazy and is wrong. And it's low down and deceptive and real, real messed up. Yeah, and there's other women that are waiting around to get have their turn and have their fun with this man. Yeah. Feeling, yeah, there's a lot of other women here. There could be men here as well, too. There's a lot of group sex, a lot of sex here. This was supposed to hurt you, Divine Feminine. Like, this woman wanted to hurt you. But you ain't never did nothing to this woman, you know? You ain't never did nothing to this woman. You just who you are. Mm -hmm. This masculine is not coming. I feel like he's not coming. And he could be like, the only person he came in is this Divine Feminine. The, the star, the Empress. Yeah. Yeah. It's the only person that get his nut. So another thing is, is that he's not nutting. He's not coming in these women. And that's what this 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 uh, karmic wants. She wants a baby. She wants a baby. So she's trying to work it, work work on things with him. There's a lot of drinking here to get this baby. She's trying to get him as drunk as possible so that she can get this nut up out of his man. 
but she, all they do is drink and fuck. Yeah. That's all they do. And she want she wanna want him to run away. Let's run away together. Let's be together. Come on. Me and you. I feel like also he was supposed to with the Knight of Wands, he was supposed to like be her. Like she was she she was supposed to be saving him or he was supposed to be saving her. Yeah. Cause look, we have the um this this table where they're talking. So he traveled to this woman, and I basically, I guess, like, him and my family wasn't on good terms. And so this Carmen felt like she saved him and rescued him. She was, or he felt like, you know, yeah, she she felt like she saved him. Like, he was so down and out about this empress, and it's like, oh, who she think she is type energy. So, yeah, she poured into him and made him feel better, and... She did everything she, he wanted her to do. She was a pet for him, basically. She invited other women in the bedroom. She did every single thing he wanted. There was a lot of group sex here. Everything he wanted. Everything he wanted. There's some authority here, though, that's watching all of this sex go down. There's some authority here. And, um... A man could have been involved in the sex as well, too. This master could have a male lover because of this woman, too. This woman used divination, and she was watching. Um, that's what this is. So, like I said, this woman um, either... I don't know. This could be something else, but it's, it could be connected. But this woman used divination to watch divine feminine and masculine have sex. Somebody could have taught her how to do it as well, too. And then she figured it out. And she broke her own heart. Because karmic sex is different from divine sex. It's di different from the um, empress and divine feminine sex. It's two different sexes. So that, that's what pissed her off. So she got this man to do blood magic. Look, look at him. He don't even look like he in his right mind when he cutting this divine feminine empress's hair off to do magic on her. And blood magic. Look, he was asleep when she did this blood magic. He was not con fully conscious aware. Mm -hmm. And look, there's a man in the back. I feel like this man could have got raped, gang raped or raped by another man or another man came into the bedroom while they were having sex and they all just had sex. And yeah, all of this caused his, the one he want to flee from him. And he's sitting there like, why, why are you running from me? Why are you, what happened? Mm -hmm. She tied him to tell her. And look how she looking like, well, at least I'm winning and that's just that. And he's just sitting there like out of it, bro. Like the nigga is just, look at this. He just out of it. And she's just like, well, look, you know I mean? I ain't buying, hey, I got what I want. Like this is crazy, wow. All they do is have sex. Like, that's it. Yeah, the magician. I feel like he, he's trying, this man is trying to also get you to not have sex with somebody else. He wants you to not have sex with nobody else. But he can't, you can't ask somebody to put their life on hold for you because you act like you couldn't have a conversation. You should have opened your mouth and communicated. But you, your throat chakra is blocked by a matriarch in your life. A lot of things have been brought for you by this matriarch that's in your life, by your own parents. Because they do magic. I'm pretty sure that is being revealed too. Everybody involved that's doing this dark magic that do this dark magic. All this shit is coming out. And another thing is that you should have been more aware to work on yourself. But you are surrounded by people who do low vibrational things. And you are what you surround yourself around. So there was no time for anything like that. And these people also encourage you to do low vibrational things. They never ever once said no. They never ever once not had the money for it either. So it is what it is. But no, you can't do magic to stop this divine feminine from going towards somebody else and having a passionate time with them. You can't send no message either because she's not trying to hear that. This woman got to go on with her life. I'm sorry. 
You tried to give her also extra responsibility so that she couldn't go on with her life. You cannot do that. You're not God. You have to give this person a fair shot at finding what they want because you messed up your shot or you were connected to somebody that messed up your shot. Somebody didn't like the position that they had even though they agreed to that position, but they only agreed to finesse. Once that finesse didn't work, they went behind the scenes and they imagined and clicked up and it would, you know, and all that other shit. And this is what happened. But I'm sorry, this divine feminine is leaving. And the only way to break this entity attachment is for the divine feminine to leave fully and, and release you fully. But just because that, that happened, yeah, it's going to break the entity attachment and it's going to turn you off from the karma. But that's, that's not going to stop this karma from doing magic, more magic on you and getting other people involved to do magic on you and getting other people to get attached to you. And the way you're going about trying to get rid of this entity, you need to stop. Stop doing that. Stop having sex with all these people. But you know what? You can't. I don't know what to tell you. Mask on. I don't know what to tell you. I don't know what to say. But... I'm going to do one more reading, and that's it. So that was the reading, part two, collective. Thank you all so much for the love and support. Please remember to like the channel, like the reading. And um, live and learn and love life. And y'all do work on yourself because there's people out here that will reduce things like this all a lot of spite greedy like this is a crazy world you gotta be afraid of people you really do but thank you have a good one